Crews with the Madison Fire Department and Madison Gas and Electric are working to figure out what caused an explosion that hurt two people this morning. The explosion happened just before 8 this morning on Broom Street. That's in downtown Madison. Tonight, Chloe Morrissey talks with someone who felt the explosion and got it all on video. The smell of gas is still strong near Broom Street in downtown Madison after a morning explosion, causing manholes to fly and smoke to rise from the ground. Some people managed to get this moment on video. Gordy Young was co-hosting his morning radio show when all of a sudden... Good Lord. Well, what was that? I think that was a... Thunder, I sure. think. It shook the table, shook the window next to us, and... Um, it was definitely uh, impactful. He was sitting inside of Shortstack on West Johnson Street when he felt the explosion. Moments later, more crews showed up and shut everything down, and people rushed outside to see what happened. We could see smoke coming up uh, right off of the sidewalk half a block away uh, from a grate or maybe from where that manhole cover blew off. I'm not sure. So it was, uh, it was definitely a little scary. MFD and MG&E are working to figure out the cause of the explosion that many people felt, whether it was in person or through the screen. You know, when you're live on the air and something like that happens that is completely not a part of the program, you just want to try to react correctly and uh, not get too shook up. You've got to continue on with the show and we were just wrapping up, so that's what we did. Madison fire officials say the two construction workers hurt are now recovering and will be okay. Reporting in downtown Madison, Chloe Morrissey, 27 News.